morning, everybody. Just as our teacher said, we are not going to teach, but we are going to give you just an overview idea about our lesson plan. Our lesson plan is very simple. It is designed for beginners. Okay, so it's about our topic is about good students habits. So before the activity introduction or presentation of the activity, you are going to ask your students about the, some vocabulary related to school. How do you get the school? How do you go to school, etc. So in order to activate your pre knowledge. So previewing activity, in, in this stage students listen to the song, first listening, and this is the song. Students listen to, to the song and then do the gap filling activity and trying to exercise new vocabulary. They may know, as you know, beginners, student, teacher, book, but they may not know test, uh, note taking, pay attention, and so on. The second viewing, so we have the first viewing again with, within this stage. Students listen and watch the video and try to self correct. So we try to to do a kind of self-correction. Then we try to discuss the students' answers using a phrase frame technique. We go then check check the answers of the students and try to, to discuss their answers. In the third stage, students uh, try to list uh, the habits of, of good students using the video. So you may show the video to the students, then you do kind of phrase frame. What does he do in this picture? What, he usually, what does he usually do? And so on. How, uh, how he usually get to the school? And so on in order to list those habits of, uh, of good students. That's it for those two stages, previewing and viewing stage. The uh, post viewing stage, we have uh, multiple choice, another multiple choice exercise. Okay, okay good morning, everybody. <coughs> so, as a, a post viewing activity, we have a multiple choice exercise for practicing the simple present. So, uh, as you will see in the handout, Just, just follow, just 
Okay. As you will see in the handout, the first uh, <coughs> exercise is about multiple choice of uh, present simple. Uh, exploiting the, the habits coming from which which are uh, which come through the, the video. Uh, you try to, to practice simple present by giving a uh, multiple choice exercise, for example, by asking students uh, to choose between does or do according to the pronoun, uh, uh, subjective pronouns. Then, uh, after that, you move to the teacher moves to discussion of correct answers with the students. Uh, then comes a writing exercise. <coughs> students write sentences about their everyday habits using the simple present through answering questions. There are some questions we have, which are in the exercise. All what students to do is try to answer those questions listing uh, some habits from their own experience. From yeah. Examples, for example, how do you usually get up, when do you take breakfast, how do you go to school, etc. In order to help them, because they are being asked. Students bring their experience, try to bring their experience to them. And as a follow up viewing activity, just give the opportunity to the student to read silently the, the, the script in order to be familiar with, 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 with the song, to be familiar with new vocabulary. And then you, you may play the, the whole video, the whole sequence, when students can, uh, can follow the video and sing at the same time. So, so the focus is, is all about the four skills. There is, there is writing, there is listening, there is speaking, and there is reading too. That's all. Thank you. Thank you.